Morning guys. I am up because I'm going to start working out today. Today's going to be my first day to like attempt to lift weights and I'm very excited. So it is pre-workout time, AKA zip this time. Yes, and I got black cherry today and I'm very excited. I got my bottle opener. Yes, okay. It's still kind of early, but like I've been committing to getting up earlier and making more use of the time that I have throughout the day. Like I want that to speak to somebody. Like, are you making the best use of your time? Like we're all busy, but we get the same 24 hours. So like, if you don't feel you're doing the most, like do the most. 2019 is the year of doing the most. Today is the day Ooh, of Black Cherry Zip Fizz. Ooh, and that's a good day right there. Okay guys, you know what time it is. Maybe I can shake some of that sleep off me cause like I'm not feeling it today, but I'm here though, but I'm up. In three, two, one. <laughs> to a productive day. Woo. Ah, <sighs> black cherry is my favorite. Let go. Good boy, good girl. Good boy, Milton. Good boy. Oh, good boy. Good girl, matey. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay, guys, it is breakfast time and I am pumped because I got egg loaf and bacon. I'm really sad because I left my sausage at the shop so I can't have any today, <laughs> but when I get there, I will have some, but this is just egg loaf and three pieces of bacon. I put a little bit of sugar-free syrup on top, so let's give it a try. Oh, so good. Oh, tastes just like the perfect combination of pancake, French toast, scrambled egg, like I put the maple extract in there. I put the cinnamon on top, put the vanilla, like this is so good and so easy to make. Like, ugh, it's so worth it. Okay, I'm having this and then next is a fat bomb. Okay guys, the moment of truth. Time for these Slim Fast Keto Fat Bombs. Now I'm looking at the size of these things. For me, a serving is gonna be two. Like there's no way I'm just eating one of these. So for two of them, it's 18 grams of fat, two net carbs, and two grams of protein. So that's not bad. Opening the package. Oh, it looks like a peanut butter cup. I mean, this is good. Honestly, not as flavorful as I thought it would be. It's kind of bland. Can't really taste the peanut butter. The chocolate taste is okay. Honestly, everyone told me how addictive and how great these things were, but like, I just think they're like meh, which is okay. I mean, they're good and I'm gonna eat it. Back to work. Okay guys, just keeping you completely in the loop. After that fat bomb, I did have a piece of Orbitz gum. I haven't had gum in a long time and I forgot how much it really helps me to like get over my thoughts of food and to move on. So. That gum was awesome. And then I cracked into, or I'm going to crack into an orange mango ice drink. Like I have yet to run into a flavor of ice drink that I don't like. And I don't feel bad about doing it because today before I had any other beverages, I finished 20 ounces of water. Somebody congratulate me. Cause it's like, I normally don't even drink that much. So I'm starting that this week. I'm going to drink one container of water, and that's in addition to the Zip Fizz. So I'm having a Zip Fizz, and then I fill this up with regular, high quality H2O, and then I'm gonna drink that, and then I can have either a Powerade or an ice drink. So 
I am focused back on work for a little bit until it's time to make my BPC. You later. <laughs> BPC you later? No? Okay, got it. Okay. salt every time and then I remember to use it and I'm like I gotta remember to use salt now is also probably a great time to try my homemade fat bombs oh let me go get them okay here's what my homemade fat bomb looks like it just looks like a chocolate bar I sweetened it with sucralose and I put some peppermint extract in there I just got it out of the freezer but I put them back in the refrigerator sometimes the freezer you know is a little too much I don't want to hurt myself again fat bomb of death but I do like them to be cold and not room temperature, so let's give it a try. Now this is good. This tastes like a chocolate bar with some mint in it, and I will take it. It's exciting to know that I can just mix chocolate and coconut oil together and get something that I like. Overall, this tastes good. I might continue to play with like the different flavors, like peppermint. I might throw some coconut in here one day, like, but it's good to know that I have a base to start from. The recipe for this, very easy. 56 grams of Baker's chocolate, 56 grams of coconut oil, sweetener slash flavorings of your choice. That's it, heat them up, let them cool. Heat them up, let them cool. Like, that's all there is to it. <sighs> okay guys, the work day just got away from me and I'm eating so much later than I want it to be. I am so hungry right now. So I have prepared like the most delicious looking taco bowl like underneath all of this deliciousness is ground beef and then I have some lettuce right here I have cheese I got this big old plop of sour cream I got these jalapenos I got this hot sauce and you guys there's only two camps okay there's team cilantro is life and then there's team like get that stuff out of here like which one are you like clearly I am about that cilantro life so like, oh my gosh, I just cannot wait to dig into this. I'm gonna give you a little sample. It's just so savory and delicious, but wait, there's more. Look what I'm enjoying with it. Oh my gosh, these chili lime tortilla chips. Let's look at that. Ugh, they look so amazing. Just gonna, so spicy. So delicious. So this is the perfect reward after a long work day. I'm gonna eat this, probably gonna have some jello, and then I'll be back to wrap it up. All right guys, you know what time it is. I got my jello. I've started on another Powerade that I probably won't finish today, but that's what tomorrow's for. So I'm just gonna have this and then just chill out the rest of the night. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly what I eat Wednesdays, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate unboxings, and the occasional product review. You can also catch me on Instagram and Facebook at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks and I'll see you next week.